Hello everyone, today I'm going to explain a movie, the title is Greyhound with uh, Svetan Todorov theory, just correct me if I spell it wrong. Alright, Greyhound is a 2020 American war film directed by Aaron Schneider and starring Tom Hanks who also wrote the screenplay. The film is based on the 1955 novel the Good Shepherd by C.S. Forster and also stars Stephen Graham, Rod Morgan, and Elizabeth Shue. It just this film was was just released in 2020. All right, before we continue, I want to uh, explain briefly about uh, five stage of the door of theory. So, uh, in narrative, a narrative story, there is a uh, five stage. Whereas there is an equilibrium, disruption, recognition, attempt to repair, and restored equilibrium or new equilibrium. All right? The equilibrium is the state balance where uh, there is a normal thing in the t in story. And disruption is there is a something uh, disrupt the balance or disrupt the equilibrium. Either it's character or nature or something else. That's something that. Uh, disrupt them and then recognition when the main character or the protagonist realize the, what happened realize the situation and they and they or he need to fix the situation and then attempt to repair when uh, uh, tension reach a peak where is uh, the main character, the protagonist, is trying to re uh, restore the new normal, new equilibrium. And then the last stage is restored equilibrium, where is the, there is a new normal, uh, there is a new balance after the disruption. All right. Uh, so the background story of this movie is a uh, convoy. Allied convoy in World War Two that crossing Atl Atlantic. So they crossing the Black Pit. Uh, here is the Black Pit. So the Black Pit is area where is, there is no air cover between uh, Atlantic Ocean. So you can you see here. Uh, there is a range of Royal Canadian and Iceland. So there is a, there's an area where is, there is no air cover. So this is the most vulnerable area where is the wolf pack is attack the Allied convoy. So this story is uh, is tell us about uh, USS Greyhound, which is a fictional ship that doesn't really doesn't exist exactly, but uh, based on what really happened in here. So there is a convoy HX25 to River Liverpool, England, consisted of 37 troop and supply ship escorted by four light ship led by Greyhound. Okay. The equilibrium. The equilibrium start with conversation between the captain and uh, this woman and damn I forgot the name. And there is a uh, some conflict between the crew. It's a little conflict and they uh, apologize and regret incident and this is the balanced state of the movie where is uh, the crew overwatch this round the situation and uh, trying to look something wrong actually there is it is the difficulty of war movies where is uh, where is the disruption is is predicted you know, they predicted there's something wrong, it's really gonna happen, so they prepare for it. And then disruption. Uh, the crew reports there is a German transmission ahead. And they re realize in the first, the first one, there is a U-boat, so they attempt to destroy it. And they did, they destroyed the U-boat. And then the the U-boat is uh, 
inform the other U-boat. That's what. That's why they called themselves as Wolfpack, where they're uh, attacking the convoy as a group. All right. So they attack the convoy with uh, with group of U-boat as a as wolf attack their uh, their their hunt. So the the character the crew in this movie realize that there is various German transmission. It means the German. The U-boat trying to inform all U-boat available in that area that there is a convoy here. Come on, let's attack them. So they told there is a wolf pack scouting them and preparing to attack. So after the main character realized it, so they trying to repair it. There is a time of repair. So I found in this movie there is two attempt to repair so the first one is the captain told uh, the CEO that uh, the ship must break the poor protocol whereas the ship is running zigzag to avoid uh, German recognition so they will not going zigzag but going straight away to cut the travel time to reach air cover immediately they realize this is a big convoy, so they need fast. They need to uh, reach the air cover as soon as possible. So, as you see, they are zigzagging to avoid the German U-boat, but there is not always work for that. So they can in the uh, air cover in 24 hours. After fierce fighting, they lost several convoys and British destroyer Eagle is uh, sink by U-boat torpedoes. As you say here, the Erie Captain Erie lost Eagle. Harry and Dicky almost run out of the fuel, as they are. So they can have a small protection for the convoy. And absolutely, it is obvious that they are need air cover. So they attempt the second attempt to reach air cover is send message to Admiralty, which is a uh, uh, British Navy at the time. They call it Admiralty to uh, to ask them to send reinforcement as soon as possible. So they want to send radio message, but at that time there is no encryption. So when you send a radio message, it will pass by the enemy. So the enemy will be know what are you talking about. So the radio is one frequency and German is watching all direction of frequency. So if you send message, the German will know about it. So uh, the Captain Erie was worried if he send message to Admiralty, are they gonna break this radio silence and told them that this convoy are really vulnerable for the wolf pack? Then the message is help. It just not help. The Admiralty will be know about it. So the new equilibrium. After the fierce fighting, uh, that I uh, it will wasting time if I cover in here. There is a very dramatic scene where is the U-boat uh, come up and shooting the ship, and the ship is running out of depth charge. Yeah, it's very dramatic scene. There is appear new equilibrium. So where is the air cover come in? They say the uh, the signal. The, uh, the the password all right it's uncle William and this answer ba uh, Baker dog and there's the PBY Catalina from Royal Navy come in to provide air cover so they recognize there is a U-boat in in the water and they drop the depth charge if you can see them so the British uh, 
British destroyers con convoy escort is coming to replace the convoy escort from Greyhound and in their crew so the Royal Navy uh, informed the Greyhound to make a verbal contact in radio you see here Diamond Greyhound are you copy? Yes, loud and clear, Greyhound. We hear you have a difficulties, and the uh, Royal Navy will replace the convoy escort until Liverpool, and Greyhound, Eagle, and Harry will go to London Dairy to ref refit and repair. So there is a new equilibrium. Where is the Overwatch? They Overwatch. They almost Overwatch the enemy. They're always ready for anything so there is new this new equilibrium and the film is end and I think that's it from me to explain the uh, uh, the uh, uh, Greyhound movie according to uh, Western five stitch theory thank you